channel, my name is Jamie, and this is Let's Talk About It. So today I am here with what I got for Easter. So I am so into like skincare, hair care, all that stuff. My boyfriend hooked me up this Easter. Scented Pleasures by Lena. So this is the Easter one. She made this basket up. It's got a basket, a really nice embroidered bunny face basket, okay? It's got the bow around it unbelievable but the back has a um these sponge a sponge like the little puffles puff sponges i forgot what these were called but it's the puff ones and it's white so it looks like a bunny tail all right number one the packaging is like wow scented pleasures so Let's just take a nice look at how she did this if you're getting a gift for somebody, which this was my gift. I got up on Easter and he had this out and I was like, what? I, I'm getting an Easter basket? Let me open this up. I've been looking at it for a couple of days. Everything comes in here. It's not just bath bombs. So this is a whole little like experience unboxing. So if you like this, I'm going to put the link in the description because I know that she sells to everyone, I think. So there is an instruction packet in here. All right, so there's all different sections, directions. Okay, so the first thing on here, we're gonna go with a bath bomb. This is, and it's all Easter themed. This is the Easter basket bath bomb. Uh, lemon and strawberry, oh. Okay, next is, okay, so this is organic whipped shea butter body vanilla cocoa. Ooh. Infused with cocoa butter and avocado oil. Revive, moisturize, and protect. Little goes a long way, she says. Let's smell this. I'm like, oh, it smells. Look, and so it looks like some something like food, and it smells like food, so watch out. It smells like uh, vanilla cocoa. So this is nice. Okay. Uh, let's put it on. All right, so I took a little out. All right. Uh, oh, oh, my, I needed this so bad because I go to like Walmart and I get the Vaseline intensive care lotion for my body. My body needs lotion. Like I need lotion when I get out of the shower. I feel like I'm drying up. And uh, I spend a lot of money on those because I, put a lot in there and I'm always going to the store so this is so nice that I have a break from using the cheap shit oh she also gives this which is nice because the wooden spoon for us to not transfer um, germs like put our hands in it but I believe it's for the scrub which we're gonna go over next now this has got the sugar scrub in it it's called pink sugar whip sugar scrub and soap Fruit, uh, fruity blend of cotton candy, lemon drops, caramel, raspberry jam on a dried down of musk. So there must be a hint of musk in here, which is so nice. It smells cozy. Like this smell would stay in your like pajamas after you get out of the shower and you go to bed in the morning. You're going to smell amazing from your own body heat with this. So this is cool. So look. Wow, I'm very, 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 very excited to try these. Next, Chubby Chub Bunny. Look at the bunny. Oh my God, love it. I'm like gonna be so silky smooth. Next, so she also does, uh, what came in this bundle here was a cranberry apple scented pleasures wax melt. My dog's barking. <laughs> My dog is barking. Oh, I hate when he does this while I film. Please don't mind him. All right, so I can't smell it through it, but 100% soy wax melt. Hand poured into Bedford Mass, and that's where I live, so that's cool. So I love wax melts. All right, so next is, this is like a pop, and it's a bath bomb pop. I, I don't think I've seen these yet. Jammin' Lollipop Bubble Bar. Directions. Oh, this is different than a bath bomb. All right, directions. Break off half or part of the bubble bar that you'd like to use and hold bubble bar under running faucet until desired bubbles. Bubble bar may cut up into twos or threes for more use. 
You can also chop bubble bar and place in a mesh strainer or nylon bag. The higher your water pressure, the more bubbles it will produce. So the scent of this is hard rock candy. Yum. Jam and lollipop bubble bar. So this is what it is. And it's gorgeous. Next. This is a Shea Butter Solid Lotion Stick. Oh, I've never heard of a lotion stick. So this is what this looks like. So you kind of do this. Oh, I love these for my tattoos to make them shiny. Basically, you just do what I did and it's awesome. Natural and organic. So everything in here is natural and organic. Next is uh, another bath bomb. This thing is stacked with bath bombs. Now this is called the Rainbow Sherbet Waffle Bubble Bath Bomb. This is a big, big one. This is the biggest bath bomb I've ever seen. It looks like ice cream on a waffle. So it's a waffle with ice cream on it. Uh, next is another Apple Jack Peel. Apple Jack Peel. We love apples around these pots. Apples and cranberries in New England. Wow. So I'm excited to get that. So that's two of those. It should say warning, do not eat. <laughs> it smells like food and it looks like food. But this is a bath bomb and cut half of, oh this is a bubble bar. So this is another one of those uh, bath bars where you can make a bubble bath and you can kind of like, like chip some pieces off and put it in a strainer, which is wicked cool. So I am so happy to have that. It's called the Cinnamon Bun Bubble Bar. This is called the Love Spell Bubble Bar. Next is Whip Soap Jam and Rock Candy. I love rock candy. Cherry, raspberry, strawberry, grape, orange blossom, peppermint, and vanilla. Right away I smell the grape. It looks good, right? Like you wanna eat it. Next, this is never ending this bag. This looks like a, like a, like a, almost like a cake. Like a cake, like a little cake that you get when you cut into and all stuff comes out. That's what it looks like, one of those. But not chocolate. Or is it a donut? I don't know, but this thing's hella big. Um, and this is a bath bomb, so I guess you just do the halfway thing until it floats on its own and then you can see all the art. Next is another bath bomb. Uh, love. This one is a, is called Love. And then we have, oh, I like this. I'm excited about what this one smells like. This is another um, um, soy wax melt. Um, this one is Home Sweet Home. And next is these little bunny, um, Bunny, it's a bunny tail butt with the feet. Oh my god, so cute. It's called Bunny Bum. <laughs> bunny Bum. Oh my god. I can't wait to smell these. I'm going to be like running to the bathtub. It must be easy to get kids to take a bath today with bath bombs. We did not have bath bombs when I was a kid. What we did have was they were these little balls and it had oil in them. And they smelled. And you put them in the bathtub and it would burst and you would have little beads of smelling oil in there like but it ended up being bad for my skin my skin was always irritated when I got out so it wasn't good for me I don't think it was as like natural as things are today because that was in like the 80s <laughs> this bath bomb is just so impressive to me look at this damn thing so this is like a, a, a round bath bomb but it's got a sliver slice of um, a lime, which lemon and lime are my favorites. Anything lemon and lime, I love. And this is coconut lime verbena bath bomb, and it looks like a dessert. It's got like, like um, almost like a frosting with those little pearls that you find on wedding cakes, uh, those candies, it looks like that. So this is gorgeous, I love that. And then it comes with, thoughtfully, it comes with this. I thought this was so cool. What a nice little addition to a like little basket. What I got from my boyfriend, this, this little basket was so nice. This was such a nice touch to this basket because 
you often forget like, oh, I could have used one of these. So this is cool. I love that. And then I've got two more things that I have that she has made for me before. Um, but I didn't use them because they were so beautiful. To me, I did never wanted to use them in a bath because I didn't want it to go away. So I'm going to show you those now. All right. So around Halloween time, I think it was, she gave us these. I'm obsessed with clowns, so this is a clown bath bomb. It's called Creepy Carlito. And then this one is the Night King, Game of Thrones, he said. This girl does it all. This stuff is like primo. And I've also used one of her soaps. I was going to save it for the video because it was so beautiful. It looked like a slice of cake, but I used it instead. It was a bar soap, and it was lemon. I want to say it was lemon meringue pie, but it was it was just lemon in like maybe vanilla. It was it had a little slice on it like the lime and I use it in the bath. I feel so good and I just I love this. Thank you Lena for this amazing basket. Thank you to my boyfriend for getting this for me. <laughs> and if you liked any of this stuff that you've seen and you want this or you want one of these things please contact Lena at scented pleasures scented pleasures by Lena and I will leave all the information down below and check her out and put an order in so guys if you liked this video please press like subscribe and I'll see you later